Yes, I know I look like trash. I tweeted out, hey, I'm going to the mall in my pajama pants. Do not judge me. And no one did, so it's not your guys' turn to judge me. Hello everybody, my name is Periwinkle, and today I have an exciting video for you guys. It is my back to school haul, which I am so excited for. I'm like bouncing up and down because I got some of the coolest stuff, and it's really nice, and I'm kind of like, oh. Mm, that's awesome. Basically, um, yeah, I'm gonna show you all what I got. First thing is I got yesterday at the fair, and um, you know, it was only ten bucks. I don't even know if I should include it, but I am, and it is this henna tattoo. It's actually really cute. I'm digging it. It's an infinity sign with an anchor in it, and I thought it was really cute, and it kind of has that anchor message, which I really like behind it, and I'm, I love it. <laughs> it costed ten bucks, so it was, it was cheapo. Thing I got was a new otter box. If you guys remember, my otter box from last year was like trash, or like my otter box like from yesterday basically is trash. It's completely and utterly nasty. So I got a new one for school, and this one's so pretty. And ooh, babe is typing, but it's honestly so pretty, and I'm obsessed. So the first thing I'm gonna start with is a VS or Victoria's Secret. What I got was um. This. Ooh, oh, I almost dropped the bag. That would have destroyed me. Um, I got this really cute shirt. It's, you know, the classic pink style. It's really rainbow and nice and it has stripes on the sleeve. Well, actually, it says pink on the sleeve. Never mind. I thought I, I thought it was, it was cool. And I also got this bath bomb, which looks like it's from Bath and Body Works, but... I went back and looked at him, and Bath and Body Works is like $8, and this was like $6.50, so I was like, yep, I'm gonna get this one. And it's called Vibes, and it has like, I don't know what this is, but I'm gonna use it um, Tuesday when I take, I have this ritual, I always take a bath before I go to, um, before like the day before school starts. So, I'm gonna use that Tuesday, and I'll, I'm kind of excited for it. It looks really nice, and smells even nicer, so, just to hint, a life hack, um, Bath bombs are cheaper at Victoria's Secret. I don't know if all Victoria's Secret have bath bombs, but trust me. I also got Taco Bell, by the way. Next, I went to one of my favorite, well, let me reiterate, favorite stores. Room 21. They have, like, always the best deals, and I always go love going there for Black Friday, because, oh my god. They have the best sales on Black Friday, and they also have best sales in their life, so, yeah. The first shirt I got was of this one, and it is a cropped pretty it's so comfy and it is kind of like tie-dye but again it's super comfy thinking i can wear it with the new high-waisted pants and oh my god so soft like i wish you guys could feel this the next thing i got was th this death leopard shirt and i really do love death death leopard um and it's got this uh little mesh area here and it's got some holes on the side it's very uh what's it called it's ripped. Yeah, that's a good word to describe it. Very distressed is what it's called. And I really liked, I like distressed stuff and also like bands. So it works. These color correctors. Um, I have a powder color corrector right now and it's basically almost out. So I got these. I got a peach one, which helps cover dark spots and pigmentation on skin. It, and then I got a purple one, which neutralizes yellow tones and dullness. I actually have a lot of red, uh, what am I talking about? I actually have a lot of red spots, so. But purple one will work. And then I got a yellow one, which reduces the appearance of dark under eye circles. Need that. And then a green one, which neutralizes redness. And then a regular concealer, so. I'm super excited. These are only $6, so. Like, I don't know if they're good quality or not, because I have never bought, bought makeup from Rue 21, but would recommend if these are good and not like patchy or anything. I've always wanted like strappy sandals because you know, with heels. I got these, oh my gosh. These are gorgeous. They are, um, they've got zippers on the side and these little patterns in here and heels, oh my gosh. Heels just make my legs good, look good, so. You know, and they aren't scuffed at all. A lot of the shoes they had were scuffed, so it's kind of like, I have the holy grail, and I mean the holy grail, of everything. Basically, I went to Hot Topic, and girl, I love Hot Topic, mm. and they opened up a new store in our mall, 
like um they had another store and then victoria's secret bought out that area so they had to move and this store is a lot wider and oh my gosh they had a full wall full of t-shirts and it was hard to narrow it down to one but i got this one which is a really cool uh black tie-dye and i don't know this always reminds me of halloween or the opening scene in harry potter <laughs> and it says i am not a social butterfly i am a sarcastic moth which is basically that's basically how I am. And I bought it oversized just because I love oversized t-shirts and I can tie it up in the front and wear it with jeans. A pop socket because pop sockets are really in and I've wanted one, haven't really got the chance to buy one and I saw one and it was marble and I was like, oh, $9.90, I'm going to get it. So I got it and I'm really glad I did because it's going to go well on my new phone. It's so cute. I love it. Next, I went to Bath and Body Works and I just bought one thing here. So, yeah. But basically, I um got this candle for ten dollars and something cents, but just ten dollars. Usually they're twenty two, but I had a coupon, so. <laughs> but um, I do have a fall candle from last year. It's pumpkin French toast. It smells super fall like, and I'm gonna try to finish it up. But I knew I need another one because there's only like a little bit left. So I'll probably finish up my summer one I have over there, which is what is it? Pink lemonade punch or something? Something pink lemonade punch. We'll say that. And it smells super good. And the French toast one um, smells good too. But this new one, oh my gosh. I'm so excited. So, as you guys know, fall's around the corner. And I love fall scents. I'm probably going to be blaring this all the way up until like Black Friday because that's when I bring my Christmas stuff out. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at this. Oh, it smells so good. And I know. I think I bashed the original pumpkin apple scent last year in my um, haul video, like my back to school, or did I do a back to school? I know I looked at this last year, basically, and I smelled it, and it gave me a headache, and I was like, what is that? And I didn't like it, but they changed the formula or something, because, oh my god, this smells so good now, and it doesn't, it won't give me a headache, because that apple scent is much more stronger than the pumpkin, which is what I need, because too much pumpkin just gives me a headache. Next, I went to Ed Apostle, and they're having a 60% off sale because apparently they're going out of business, but they've been doing that since, like, last year, so, yeah. But I got these cute gray shoes, and it kind of has, like, snake skin or crocodile skin. It feels really nice, and I think they can go with a lot, and it's, it's cute. What can I say? It's cute. Next thing I got was, I, I got a coupon. I got a coupon thing I got was I needed new earrings and I saw on this pair which is really cute and uh, I like the cuffs on it the cuffs are pretty cute I'm a, I'm a sucker for cuffs and also you know the little gold ones it's fall time you gotta wear more, more gold jewelry and also these so um yeah it was buy one get one free so I don't know which side I got free but they're both cute the last thing I got from Aeropostle was this shirt that says huddle up perfect for back to school because you know football season it's low cut and i think it's pretty cute and again it's oversized because oversized t-shirts are the bomb and i really like the shirt like at first i was debating on buying it and then i was like what if i tie it up with a flannel and i'm like okay that's gonna be cute so i bought it american eagle and, okay let's go ahead so i got this shirt and it says all and all all this and brains too they had a bunch of feminist shirts um like, female is the future, and I'm not too intense of a, like, I don't know, it's just, I don't know how to describe it, it just, it rubs me the wrong way how people do that, but I did like this one, because, you know, I'm all for being empowered myself, and everyone being empowered and being confident, and this one gives me confidence, so I decided to buy it, and I think it's gonna be really cute with some jean shorts, I say that a lot, but it's the truth, this a bag, which I actually got for free, which I'm like, oh, and it's denim, and uh, I noticed it when she was packing my stuff that I got it for free, and I was like, because I obviously bought a lot, so, are awesome. I see these jeans everywhere, the black ones that have the slits in the knee, and I didn't even know these had the slit at the knee when I first bought them, when I first picked them up, but now I do, and oh my gosh, I'm so obsessed with this trend. It's so cute, and I got them, and they're also High waisted, and I love high waisted jeans, so that makes me happy. These brown jeans, and uh, there are some days when I'm like, leggings don't look good with this. Jeans don't either. Like, 
navy jeans don't either, black jeans don't. I'm like, oh, what should I wear with it? So I just end up wearing leggings, which I shouldn't, but these are so cute. I just kind of joke. Now I have something to wear with shirts that, um, you know, I can't really wear with anything like you know, regular jeans or leggings. I kind of have something to throw on. Next, I have two navy jeans. Um, this pair is, I think, high rise. These are the super stretchy ones, and they're skinny jeans. And this is like my first time buying skinny jeans, and they're short. Like all these sizes are short because I'm short. And they're like normal jeans. I needed some normal jeans, so I just bought them, and they're really cute. And then this pair is kind of like light wash at the front. And is this high rise? Yeah, these are high rise. I'm all for high rise jeans, and they make my butt look good. And yeah. But I love these. Anyway, I think that's it for the haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. See y'all later. Bye.